So we've got some warm sunshine in the forecast into the coming days. There is a breeze around, we've had that today. That does continue, get some shelter from the breeze though and it does tend to feel that much warmer. Some cloud around as well, it tends to form a bit by night and then shifts by day, so a bit tonight, more so I think tomorrow night, so Thursday morning could start a bit grey, but the sky should brighten. And then it's a shower into the week, so Friday into the weekend, you might still see some warm sunshine, but we see this potential for some quite lively, possibly thundery showers. At the moment, high pressure is dominating things, but we're on the edge of it, so we are getting a bit of a squeeze in those isobars, hence this breeze that we've got with us, this northeasterly, and then you can just see this potential for showers towards the tail end of the working week and into the weekend. Out there this evening, a bright end of the day for some of us. We've got this northeasterly though, and that continues to blow into tonight. And it does draw more in the way of cloud across us as the night goes on. That stops temperatures falling away far. Values should be higher than we saw last night, mostly the teens. Locally, perhaps out in the countryside, though a bit lower. But yes, we head into tomorrow. Some cloud around to start the day. Hopefully that will tend to thin and break. We should get some sunshine. And we do keep this northeasterly with us through the course of the day. But temperatures get that bit higher than today's values. So most of us are into the low 20s. Take a look at our times of high water. Chatham 124 and again at 138 into the afternoon. Uh, so yes, you might start Thursday a bit on the murky side, but skies should brighten, temperatures perhaps rising that bit higher, but come Friday and into the weekend we have got this threat of some lively showers. Take care. So some more warm sunshine in the forecast, temperatures are rising, a little bit of a breeze into some coastal areas and we have got some low cloud, a bit of cloud for tonight, more so I think tomorrow night, some low clouds, so perhaps a bit of a grey and murky start to Thursday. But Again, that should tend to clear. We should see more in the way of some sunshine. Temperatures get that bit higher, but a showery end to the week. For Friday and into the weekend, you might still see some warm sunshine, but the threat of showers, which could be quite lively and possibly thundery as well. Now, high pressure is dominating for the time being. We are slightly on the edge of it, so hence a bit of a breeze around. But yes, later on in the week, we start to see this likelihood of some showers. Out there at the moment though, it's a nice end of the day. Some sunshine around. As I say, you've got this northeasterly breeze and as the night goes on, that does draw in a bit more cloud for some of us. But temperatures should remain that bit higher than we saw last night. So we had some twos and threes last night. Tonight, most of us stay in double digits in towns and cities, probably high single digits out in the countryside. But yes, it's very much uh, frost free, unlike uh, some nights that we have seen recently. But a bit of a cloudy start for some of us tomorrow morning. That will thin and break, and we should all get to see some sunshine. So there's nice bright skies overhead, and yeah, that bit warmer, so temperatures pushing that bit higher, perhaps 23, 24, maybe even a local 25 degrees for tomorrow, which uh, should feel pretty summery. Our times of high water, Portland, 7.51, and again at 8.03 into the evening. Uh, so you might start a bit murky and grey on Thursday, but skies should brighten, some more warm sunshine in store, but yes, there's a likelihood of some lively showers to end the week. Take care.